Marie Collins appeared in court Thursday to face her fourth DWI charge, only receiving a fine from the judge. She's accepted responsibility for every single offense. Prosecutors say Collins drove drunk five times within a few months. Each time she was caught, Collins had a clean record because her prior offenses hadn't gone through the court system yet. That meant lower penalties. By operation of the law, you can't, um, you can't be charged with a second unless you're convicted with a first. Collins received fines for her first two offenses and was released. But a short time later, she was sentenced to 33 days in jail for violating bail conditions for one of her first offenses. Collins got another five days for her third DWI charge. It was important to me that she serve a separate penalty for uh, breaching the terms of her bail and penal have a penalty for, for the DUI. Collins will be released on Sunday. Prosecutors say she will be certified as a habitual offender and her license will be taken away for several years. But her family says that may not stop her from getting behind the wheel. She had the first two or three DUIs, went to Florida for two months for rehab, came back and reoffended in Dan Danbury on an aggravated DUI again. Collins' mother-in-law says more needs to be done to keep the road safe. She's proved that, it, that the process is not working for her yet. I hope that it does, but it isn't yet. Collins will be in court to address her fifth charge in March. Live in the newsroom, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.